for UCAM. It comes with a user manual, 7-inch monitor, camera, and cigarette lighter adapter. Today's project is to install a 4UCAM digital wireless camera system on this Rockwood Windjammer trailer, a 2013 model by Forest River. This trailer is 34 feet long and 10 feet high, so a ladder will help you finish the job. There is a Furion pre-wired box on the trailer, which gets the power from the running light. Now just use a screwdriver to take the four screws out and take the box off. Oops, I dropped a screw. I'm not very good at doing this job while videotaping at the same time, so I will just take the pictures along the way instead. After opening the box and the rubber cover, you can get access to the power behind the rubber cover. Just clamp the new camera's power wire onto the existing wires, then tuck the extra wires back into the hole. Turn on the running light to make sure the camera LED turns on. When you see the running light on, the LED on the camera will turn on as well, and you will know the camera is getting power. I custom cut this flat metal piece which will match the original four screw holes and connect the camera bracket, so I do not need to drill additional holes onto the trailer body. The rest is easy. Just screw the metal piece to hold down the original rubber plate. Now I try driving the screws in while videotaping again. Use the same screw holes to fix the metal plate, then install the camera bracket and hook up the camera onto the camera's bracket. That's it for the camera. Now just plug the monitor onto the cigarette lighter adapter for power. And voila! Now you see the camera image. The monitor is on the front of the F-150 and camera is on the back of the trailer. It is nearly 50 feet apart and has a very clear image. Now we do a signal range test to see how far the signal can go. I put the monitor on another car starting from 100 feet away. The signal bar is strong and image is stable. Now we start to drive further away from the trailer and camera. The signal bar is now down to 1 and the image begins to cut in and out. Now it is over 200 feet away from the trailer camera. The trailer is now very far away. It might be over 200 feet away. I do not think any of the trailers can be this long. So in my testing, the signal goes beyond 100 feet. Very impressive. It is a great rear view camera unit.